I play the role of Parker Bass, who um, she's the only female in the play, and so it's it. My initial thoughts were it, it creates an interesting dynamic having the one female in a play of only men. Um, it she is a very strong character, but also shows a lot of vulnerability a lot of the time, and so it's very interesting to to experience that with her, I guess. Let me ask you this. Since it's a, you know, a one-of-a-kind play, a very unique play written by one of your classmates, mm -hmm. but is also an award winner, a national award winner, is there extra pressure that you feel to make sure <laughs> your role is, is played at its peak performance? Uh, very, very much so. Um, we have all kind of gone, I think, above and beyond with this um, outside of just... Um, acting in the play we've all been helping build the set and making sure that it looks perfect and getting everything to where we have the best opportunity and the fact that the playwright is one of my best friends and my roommate <laughs> um i was kind of i was there with her as she was writing it through all the stages and stuff and so i want it to come to the perfect fruition for her because i think it she deserves it and she's worked really hard and she deserves the best shot at getting the recognition that she deserves <laughs> And, and uh, the fact that she's your roommate, uh, what do you just, you know, she's jetting off to D.C. next week, and you guys are going to be performing and working hard at, at, at that. What do you hope she sees when she comes back on the, what is it, the 18th she's coming back, or 19th to yeah. see the show? What do you hope she sees? I, um, she's been at a couple of rehearsals, so she's seen a little bit, but I hope that I hope that it's the image that she always pictures, because I feel like when you write something or you read a script even, you immediately picture how people are going to interact or what people even are going to interact. And the fact that she handed this over to Rusty to direct and gave her complete control over it, I just hope that we, we create what she saw in her head the entire time. And last question. Um, the, the theater program at Newman is, is relatively new, or at mm -hmm. least the restart of it. What do you think it says to be able to do an award-winning play that one of your classmates you know, created? What does it say about just where the program is? So what do you think about that? Um, honestly, it's, I mean, just on paper, it's, it's amazing in itself having a, a play that a student wrote that's award-winning directed at your school like it's incredible as is but um when we look at the actual kcactf competition that we're going to or have the opportunity to go to um wsu participates in that all these surrounding schools these big universities compete in it and we're this tiny little school and we've got every year we've had the maximum amount of um, Irene Ryan nominations that go. We've had plays that have been very, very close to being picked. They've been in the final rounds of being picked to actually go perform. And now we've got this play, which has won an award, and now we're producing it and having the opportunities that we've had plays in the past have the same opportunities for. It's incredible to see such a small program that's so new um, go so far. And I think that Mark Manette has done a great job creating um, the program that we have, and he saw, he definitely has pushed CL, the watching that, to, to write these plays, to do the best she can, and help given all of the students opportunities that you necessarily wouldn't get at a big school.